to create product ad videos using AI models wearing your outfit. Now, the final results of this should look like something that you can see on screen. That is your model wearing your outfit, whatever outfit you have selected. And finally, you'd be able to make that model walk or dance or do whatever you want to with your outfit. Now, if that sounds interesting to you, then please stick on with me till the end of this video because in this video, I'm going to give you a step-by-step -step tutorial of how you can achieve everything right from scratch. Now, the best part over here is that I'll show you how you can get started for absolutely free as well. So if that sounds interesting, then don't skip any part of it because this is going to be a packed tutorial and I'll show you everything step by step. So for that, let's head over to our laptop. And if this is the first time that you are into this channel, then please consider subscribing to this channel because in this very channel, you get AI information just like this, which can help you to stay ahead of your competition. That being said, let's move over to our laptop and let's start the tutorial right now. So welcome to the step one, which is building your AI model. And for this, you can do it in two ways. Number one is that you can just come over to Google and search for the kind of model that you want. Now, remember one important point over here that this model that you choose should be a full body model, right? It should have all parts of the body showing in the picture. It should not be half model. So that's a thing to keep in mind. So that's why I have chosen this one. Or what you can do is that you can just head over to ChatGPT and right within ChatGPT, you can write a prompt like this, a beautiful Indian 25 year old female model, sharp features walking on the ramp, showing full body image facing the camera. And this is the output that we have got, right? And in here, as you can see, this is a full body image right so this are the things that you need to keep in mind so you can go in both ways now if you are actually using the google image then you need to make sure that you don't end up using this image directly because this can land you into copyright so for that what we need to do is that we need to again go over to chat gpt and within chat gpt we have a feature in which you can actually get the prompt for a picture so for that we just need to upload the photo over here just come over this plus click on that and click on add photos and file now i have already downloaded that image from google so let's go ahead and upload it over here so here you can see I have uploaded the image. Now what I can do is that I can ask ChatGPT to give me a prompt. And once done, I'll just hit on enter and you can see it is creating the prompt over here. Now you can actually take this prompt and then you can just head over to an image creation tool like Leonardo.ai and within Leonardo AI, you just need to come over to this image, click on that. And in here, you can just come over here and select the flux model. Just for an example, you can choose any model that you have. You can select cinematic kino as well. Now in here, you just need to paste the prompt that we have got. So I have pasted it over here and let's click on generate. Now, once you do that, you can see you get a complete new model picture and it looks quite good as well so you can go ahead and download this and use it for your reference which we will use in our step two right so in this step we have learned how you can go ahead and create your model right so we i have shown you both the ways one is directly creating it from chat gpt or taking reference of an image and then converting it into a simple new ai image so now we are going to move over to a step two which is wearing the outfit the AI model that we have created in step number one should wear the outfit that we have. Now, in general, if you are into e-commerce or drop shipping, you would have the product photo shoot, right? You have the product photos. Now, for this example, I'm going to use random photos from the internet of the products, right? So for that, we'll just go over to the Google. And in here, I can just search for women outfits. And in here, you can see there are plenty of outfits that I get. Now, if you are getting these outfits from Google, make sure that you don't take the entire photo, right? Just go over here. And in here you just need to take a snapshot of the dress itself right not the face remember this right so what i have done is that let me show you some of the pictures that i have like this is one of the dresses now you can actually go ahead and download the image and then erase the parts body parts as well that's up to you or you can find this kind of images as well so you can see i have got this kind of images now I, what i'll do is that i'll make my model wear these image right so for that we will actually use another ai tool called cling ai so let's head over to cling ai now you can just come over to Kling AI and sign up for absolutely free using your Google ID. That's absolutely free to sign up. And in here, you have this thing called all tools. Click on that. And this will take you to this portion over here. And in here, you have a thing called virtual model, right? You can see over here. Just click on that. And this will give you two options. Right in here, there is a virtual model option wherein you can build the virtual model. But we have already done it using ChatGPT and Leonardo AI. Now, we will move over to the second thing, which is the AI virtual try-on, as you can see over here. So in here, what we need to do is we can either 
either generate our AI models right within this tool or there are some default models you can see of different ethnicity and gender or we can just go ahead and upload our model as well. So let's go ahead and do that. So for this example, I'm going to use one of the models that I created using chat GPT. So you can see over here, this is an Indian model that I've created and uh, let me show you the chat GPT prompt. This is the prompt that I had used, right? You can just pause the screen and take a note of this prompt. This created this image over here and then I asked it to redesign this with a red sari and you can see this is the same image and the same AI model that I am using within Kling, right? If you notice this. Now what I'm trying to do over here is that I want to upload the garment. Now if you have a multiple part garment, say for example a top and a bottom part, then you can go for this or if it is a single garment, then we'll choose the single garment. Then just click on upload and in here you need to upload the garment that you have. So let's go ahead and actually upload this garment over here. So as you can see, this has been done, right? Now we can select the number of outputs over here. If we want to, we can go ahead and select up to four variation of the output. I'm selecting couple and let's click on generate. Now, by the way, there is another way in which you can do the same thing using chat GPT. Let me show you that while Kling generates this, right? So if we head over to chat GPT, you can see this one over here. What I can do now is that I can just go over here and then upload this image within chat GPT. Now to upload an image, as I've already shown you, you just need to come over here, click on this plus sign and click on add photos, right? And with that, I have uploaded this image of the outfit that we had. And on the prompt, I've written, please redesign this model image with the uploaded dress, camera facing and make the whole body from head to toe visible. You can take reference of this prompt as well. No issues. So once I had done that, you can see it has generated this outfit AI model as well. So this is quite amazing. This was entirely done by chat GPT. By the way, let's go ahead and see how Kling actually does the job for us. So you can see Kling has created this so let's go ahead and see and again this looks beautiful as well right you can see both of them looks quite amazing so that was our second part done and dusted which is making the ai model wear our custom outfit now we'll head over to our third and final step that we have which is to convert this into a video so to convert this into a video all that we need to do is select one of these images as you can see over here this looks quite good so we can just go ahead and click on generate video as soon as i do so you can see it takes us to this video generation and in here you can see you can choose the cling model as of now cling 2.0 it has been released right now and it's very hot right now but if you choose that you can see 100 credits would be used up now i have a pro plan of cling so i can use that no issues but if you are using playing for free you get 166 credits so if you are generating one video for 100 credits i think you'd be exhausted so what i would suggest you to do is that you can come for this cling 1.6 which is also quite good you can use this no issues at all and in here you have a prompt so on the prompt just make sure that you actually write anything that you want your model to do so let's actually give a prompt over here so i have said like the girl walks on the ramp and then stops and turns around and makes show stopper gestures right and in here i will go for a 10 second because i have given a lot of things so let's go for 10 second video and in here you can just change the creativity and relevance but i would say keep it as it is and once it's done i'll click on generate and let's wait for the results and boom as you can see over here it has been generated so let's click on this and it would load up over here so let's actually go ahead and play this you can see this this looks amazing right i must say this looks quite brilliant right all the things that i have said it has done and it has done it beautifully so that being said you can see over here right in front of your eyes i have been able to develop this now all that you need to do is go ahead and check this without watermark and click on download now remember if you are on a free plan then it won't be downloaded without watermark but then you can find your ways right so that being said i i'm just downloading this now re remember you can use this as your own video on your e-com stores you can use it on your drop shipping products you can use it for your amazon flipkart listing wherever you wish to this is quite amazing and the total cost to create this is absolutely zero but if you go the traditional way you need to hire a model you need to use up the dress also you need cameraman you need lights you need stage you need backdrop you need everything so there is a huge cost associated so that's the power of ai that's how ai is going to replace the traditional way things are done so if you are not learning ai my friend you are going going down the barrel so make sure that you start learning ai if you haven't already and make sure that you focus on learning ai so that being said it brings me to an end of this little tutorial i really hope that you guys have enjoyed it if you have help me with a like let me know in the comment section if you have got any other questions i'll be trying to answer it and if you have not subscribed as yet my friend 
please go ahead and subscribe it and it will make sure that you stay ahead of the race so that being said we'll meet again pretty soon somewhere over the internet until then please take care of yourself and your families and don't forget to keep making money online signing off is shine take care bye bye